Nothing we do in this life, even napping in the sun in the morning, is permanent. The illusion of permanency in the modern Western world is one that can easily get you into trouble, which is exactly what's been happening to me for the last six weeks. Hi, Bob. What are you doing? Bob's not the smartest turtle in the tank, but he makes up for it with his devilishly good looks. I've been a little bit absent from this channel over the last month. I've had a lot going on and trying to make sense of it has taken up an extraordinarily large amount of my time. See, over the last month, I've had a lot of stuff happen that I've had to pivot very hard. I've been trying to set up new income streams because essentially I lost my job. <laughs> essentially, Facebook decided to demonetize my platform. They didn't give me any policy strikes. I haven't done any copyright strikes. There's nothing there that I have done on my end. They simply changed their monetization policy. And I went from being able to make about $100 to $150 for a full length, say, five to eight minute video down to making about three bucks as i can no longer utilize that platform for anything even though i have half a million followers on there i spent eight years building that channel eight years of my life dedicated into that and they took it away overnight nothing i could do about that i've tried there's no recourse no one you can contact and that's okay i i just have to figure out new ways of doing things and that's why i've been absent here because i've been building things like my twitter account i've been building a rumble account and i've been doing amazon stuff and so on and so forth but it does make me wonder what facebook's thinking of doing because i know that i'm not the only person that this has happened to <laughs> and i'm sitting here thinking to myself geez are they trying to force creators to abandon their platform like for real think about it if you're not going to pay the people who are making content for you for free as a full-time job so that they can make such quantities of content for you for free, then you're going to have less content creators and therefore you're going to make less money. So I'm just going to assume here that Facebook is a dying platform. Hell, I've been on Twitter now for a little while and Twitter's far more enjoyable than Facebook. Don't get me wrong, they're both toxic as, like, super toxic. But... They're toxic in different ways. Twitter, for all intents and purposes, seems a lot more free. I mean, I'm seeing people talk about whatever they want on there, and that's kind of cool. I've had to moderate myself over on Facebook for years, and it's really annoying. And I'm just wondering if Facebook has realized what it's done. Because I'm not the only person to have left that I've spoken to over the last six weeks. But I suppose when you've made a couple billion dollars, you don't really care, do you? Anyway, it's good to be back on this channel. Here's to making more videos.